Many people often worry about how much food they should be eating, when the real worry is what is the quality of the food I'm eating. You've seen part one where we talked about macronutrients, now we're going to look into talking about micronutrients, which are just as important, if not even more important. Micronutrients are things like antioxidants, vitamins and minerals that the body requires but in smaller doses. While nutrient rich foods contain many of these in abundance and the term superfoods are quite often used to describe them. What makes a food considered nutrient dense is that it contains a great amount of vitamins or antioxidants in it in relation to its calorie content. For example, French fries contain very little healthy nutrients and are nearly vitamin and nutrient free, yet are very high in calories from non-useful fats and starches, while something like blueberries, however, contain fewer calories and high amounts of vital nutrients and vitamins that the body finds highly useful. There are many ways to get high nutrients, low calorie foods into your diet. Colorful salads, homemade fruit yogurts, no sugar added smoothies, and making sure to get in a plenty of raw or lightly steamed vegetables. Also, eating things like kefir, sauerkraut, seaweeds, fresh berries, kimchi, and green juices can help you get some great low calorie, high nutrient foods. So next time, instead of asking yourself, how much food should I be eating? Ask yourself, what's the quality of food that I should be eating? And until next time, stay healthy and stay happy.